Hi, I'm Dr. Christopher Cortman, and now for the Mental Health Minute. This is now the fourth video on emotions. And we talked about how emotions are key to everything you do. And we talked about how emotions come not from reality or, or events or situations, but from your perception of things. And in the last video, we talked about your investments. What matters to you is what creates emotion. Now I want to talk to you about how all emotions are statements about you. Do you ever go to a movie with somebody and you come out of the theater and you're all excited or the other person's all excited about the movie and the other person says, eh, it was okay. Or a restaurant where, you know, one person is thrilled and excited, what a great meal, and the other person is like, I never want to go back there again. Our emotions are statements about us, and we could react differently, that is, perceive things differently, even though we're perceiving the very same event. You know, I tell a story about a homeless man in the street, and four people walk by this homeless person, and the first person looks over and looks away quickly and says to self, I didn't see anything. And the second person walks by and says, but for the grace of God go I. That could have been me in my drinking days. And the third person looks over and says, you know, it's no good bums like that that bring this country down. Here I am slaving every day to pay taxes for some lazy person to lie shamelessly in the street. And the fourth person walks by and says, oh, the poor soul. I wonder if there's something I could do. Walks over to the person sees that the person's sleeping, puts a $20 bill in the pocket, and walks away praying and thinking positive thoughts for that person all day long. Well, what if I told you that the homeless person is an actor lying in the street? Those reactions, those feelings, those responses of the four people are statements about them. That's somebody lying in the street. How I think and feel those are statements about me. In the final video on emotions, I want to talk about the meaning of our different emotions and the fact that they're a call to action. 